<laughs> Alright. Okay, I usually don't make videos like these because I think they're really cheesy and I think they're too spontaneous, but I am a spontaneous person. I just met, hold it, hold it, the most amazing person I've ever met in my entire life. Like, I don't want to say that right away because I kind of feel like I'm rushing things, but we talked for two hours. And he kept saying, I have to go, I have to go, I have to go. And I kept saying, don't you have to go, don't you have to go. And he never left. Um, we met at the cafe, um, the one that I always go to. It's that little um, independent cafe house which has the best chocolate cakes. Getting sidetracked. We both ordered the same thing. And so when she brought out, you know, she brought out both of them and she was like, um... You both want to come over and grab them from me? And we just got up and we grabbed our plates at the same time. <laughs> and we turned to each other. And I said hello. And he said hello. And we just sat down at the same table. We weren't sitting at that table in the beginning. That's the funny part. We, we, we just sat there accidentally. Like we forgot that that wasn't our table or something. And so we just sat down. And realized, wait, you're sitting here. So instead of getting up like it was an accident, we, we just we stayed. We have all the same interests, all of the same interests, every single one. Like, like I never met someone else who listens to, like, Cap and Jazz and will turn around and listen to Rihanna. What? Politically? Religiously? Just, just, just... We talked about so many things. It, it was so enthralling. Like, I, I couldn't believe that someone else in this town, this horrible, fucking depressing town, I couldn't believe someone was like me. And here I am this whole time bitching. You know, I'm never going to find anybody. Nobody in this town likes the things I do. And who walks into the fucking cafe? You don't understand... You don't understand. Well, you, you do understand because you're me. <laughs> but he's awesome. His name is uh, Trevor. He's originally from England. You could tell. You could tell a little bit by the way he talks. His name is Trevor. He's from England. Uh, he's just very nice. He's, he's awesome. And, um, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. He told me that he was bi, which is a plus <laughs> for obvious reasons. <laughs> I mean, do I think I could be with him? I mean, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if I'm his type or... I mean, you know, we, we have the same things in common, but I mean, I don't know if I'm his type. Everyone has their type. I, I just might not be it. And I don't know if I really want to jeopardize that, really. I don't know if I want to risk this great of a friendship, which I know it will be, trust me. We have so much in common, I don't even see how this could not be a great friendship. So I don't want to risk anything. And you know what, it's just, I mean, I met him, I met him three hours ago. And I'm already thinking like this. That's how much of a mark he left on me. I got his phone number. <laughs> of course I got his phone number. Oh my god, he plays Xbox Live. I got his gamer tag. He plays the same games. He plays the same games. <laughs> Seriously, I'm in love. <laughs> well, not really, but maybe. I don't know. Not now, but you never know. <laughs> Trevor. I didn't get his last name. But, um... It's alright. I'll get it in time for the wedding. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm serious. <laughs> I'm gonna marry that fucker. He doesn't live far either. He lives right down the road, actually. Or, like, a couple blocks, I think. So, I mean, we're not far away from each other. <clears throat> I don't know. He's awesome. I don't really know what else to say.
you know, uh, I think I'm gonna give him a call. And, um... Hang out. I'll be back later.